All right, today we're gonna be unboxing the Springfield Armory Hellcat. This is a polymer framed nine millimeter subcompact handgun. The gun will ship with two magazines. The one installing the gun is going to be a 13 round magazine with a nice uh, pinky extension with stippling on there. The other magazine is going to be their 11 round mag along with pinky extension. Also in the box you'll get a floor plate. It's got the Springfield logo on the bottom there. What you use that for is for the 11 round mag to uh, make it a flush fitting magazine. You also get a Springfield Armory branded lock, as well as a cleaning brush. And a few things in this envelope. In here you get a warning card, as well as a card asking you to join the NRA, a Viridian laser ad, complete with a promo code that will give you 50% off any of their lasers, the Hellcat manual, complete with pictures. A Springfield Armory sticker and a warranty registration card. Currently with uh, Springfield when you register uh, their firearms on their website you are getting a 50% off coupon code. Also with the firearm you will get this nice uh, Springfield branded soft pouch. It is padded on the inside. A few pockets right there, or one pocket, and zippers along the edge. So, onto the firearm. The best way to describe this gun is that it is Springfield's answer to the SIG P365. We'll go over uh, comparing size with the 365 after we go over a few of the features. So, this gun has a 3 inch hammer forged barrel. And the finish on the barrel, as well as the slide, are both a melanite finish. On the top there, you have a visual round chamber indicator and these uh, front and rear serrations the rear ones uh, wrap all the way around on the top and get a nice set of uh, iron sights so that uh, that rear iron sight is a uh, white notch white u notch and that front one's going to be a bright yellow with a tritium insert in the middle there. Overall, that sight picture is really nice. <clears throat> Get your slide release right there. Take down lever. Mag release. The mag release is swappable to the other side. Get this nice uh, stippling or texturing on the grip that goes all the way to the top on the edge as well as in the front for your support thumb and the other side. On the bottom here, you'll get a one section, non-proprietary Picatinny rail.
Overall, it's pretty nice in the hand. I like it. You can definitely tell uh, they were they were going for a uh, P365 competitor here. So I'll go ahead and show you some of those magazines. So there's the 11 round with the pinky extension. There's the 13 round with that extension. You get a really nice grip on that. So for size comparison, bring in my P365 here. This is the NRA edition, but for size comparison, it doesn't really matter. So there's the two side by side. I'll bring it up closer. Overall, they're very similar in uh, size, grip width, and texture, and all that. I guess I would say the, the Hellcat is a, a little bit wider in the rear end there, but overall, they're very similar. Thing, uh, I'll discuss too. It does ship with a nice uh, flat face trigger. Um, they did opt to put a uh, safety bar on the trigger though, rather than what the SIG has with no safety. Overall, though, it's, it's a nice little subcompact EDC handgun you could easily carry. If you guys have any questions, let me know down in the comment section. Thank you for watching.